Hey everyone, welcome to a new mod, Painkiller Reloverdose. Now this one is a makeover of the original game that was called Painkiller Overdose. This was the second expansion pack that came out after the original game and the, its first expansion pack, which was Battle Out of Hell. Now here on the channel I have not recorded any other Painkiller game in the franchise other than the first one, so we'll go through everything, we'll go through all the cutscenes and everything that you would normally see in the original one but this time all juiced up in this mod now this one it does pretty much everything well almost everything it does very similar things that reload did to the original game um, there's a lot of new things with the weapons such as new animations when you pick them up uh, new animate new idle animations they have new sounds as well as the ammo pickups, they have improved sounds. Um, there's a lot of balancing improvements. Uh, this goes for things like with ammo and enemy placement and all that stuff. A bunch of balancing improvements. There has also been a lot of just regular fixes like bug fixes and all that stuff from the original. And there are a lot more secrets than the original. The original had very little to almost no secrets. So there's a lot of them in this one now, which is really fun. I'm looking forward to finding some of those. Now I did do a test run on this one because this this is a very new mod. This came out a little over a week ago. So I did do a test run on the first version of it just to make sure that things were running okay. And um, I didn't experience any fatal errors or anything like that. Nothing insane happened. I did have a couple of freezes and crashes. Um, but again, they, they were just crashes without error. It just closed the game. Nothing crazy. And it only happened a couple times. So nothing insane. But I do have a patch in here. There is already a patch that he released. So that, uh, that fixed a couple of things like misplaced items, a couple of extra bugs that people were experiencing. So there'll be many more patches to come, obviously. This is just the first one that he's put out. So yeah, that is pretty much everything. There's probably a few other little things that I missed and whatnot, and we'll find that out as we go along in the journey here. So let's get started. for an eternity, neither side showing mercy or remorse. Demons and angels, heaven and hell. Hate, it dominates this dominion, and the passions of both the damned and the saved are inflamed in the righteousness of their cause. And these passions must be released, often in blood, but sometimes sometimes in ways not expected. A warrior of light and a mistress of darkness give life to a child. A child of misery, wanted by none, despised by all. Hate. In that union was forged a unique being. One who was master of portals and a friend of time. But this gift was both boon and bane for the creature. He was from both worlds and therefore belonged to neither. Feared by both sides, he became a threat. An unstable element on the chessboard. So they were afraid. And a pact was made. A dirty one. Lucifer sent his best, Cerberus, to hunt down this master of portals. And the treacherous Samael stood there watching while the filthy dog ripped the wings off this creature of heaven and hell. His beauty gone, his glory perished, his realm plundered. Hate. They wanted to control him, not kill him. For who knew when this master of portals' abilities might be needed? 
So they imprisoned the wretched creature in the secret part of purgatory, away from eyes of angels or devils. A place built to hold those who should disappear. And there they placed him in a magical cage with enchanted locks, bound directly to Lucifer's life force. Hate. So here is where I, Belial, sat. Millennium after millennium, tortured and teased. But today, something different. The locks crumbled, the cage fell, and I am released. Lucifer, either dead or beaten so badly that he might as well be. Hate. I am free and filled with that emotion that has raged between heaven and hell since the beginning of time itself. Lucifer may be gone, but Cerberus... Cerberus is still alive. And Samael, that hypocritical, pompous animal. I am sure I can find him, too. I think I can find a use for this. I am consumed by rage. Rage pent up by years of frustration and captivity. Samael, I am looking for you. Hate. My path lies through the Black Tower, the gateway out of this prison of Satan's worst. And once out, I will find Cerberus. Can you sense me coming, dog? For I am Belial. Master of portals, friend to time, seeker of justice, child of hate. Alright, so there you go. There's the whole backstory of Belial, half demon, half angel, and all that good stuff. Alright, so here we are, level one, Cataclysm, and in here... So we, he, he has changed some of the card challenges as well. Some of them are still the same, but there are also a few that are different and have unique sort of tasks, which is fun. Uh, we shouldn't... Yeah, okay, we're good. All this is blank again. Um, now, there are a lot more card spaces than there are levels. There's only 18 total levels in this. So, yeah, I don't know what that is all about just yet. Um, maybe he has more plans to um, be able. You like you'll be able to unlock more cards later. I I honestly have no idea. Um, I'll have to ask him about that, or he'll see this video and maybe say something. But uh, yeah, let's get it. Fiery volcano, warm weather, stinky air, everything a half demon could want. Alright, so this is another unique thing too that is in the original game where um, Belial will say things and whatnot. He'll say something at the beginning of each level that's unique to its own. And then every now and then he'll spout off some one liners or whatever. But in the original one, there was very little of a variety that he would say. So oftentimes he would end up saying a lot of the same stuff over and over. In this one, he put either put back in or put new ones in. I don't know what he did, but he says a lot more different things now, so that's pretty cool. Seemed to be uh, in the aftermath of Vesuvius, I'm assuming, is that mountain right there. Crazy. Also, yeah, I... New weapons, skins, they're, a lot of them have similar functions to the original seven weapons from the first game, but they they have a little bit different functions, and some of, some of them are literally just reskinned versions, but they're different, so cool stuff. See so yeah, this one, it's a literal demon head that shoots a laser and screams, and that will damage enemies. And then, uh, yeah, we got four secrets in this one now, so we'll have to keep an eye out for that. Oh, yeah, also, interactive bosses, just like in Reload. That's pretty cool. I mean, not really interactive, but it's, it's there. 
Alright. Yeah, we have to destroy all objects. I'll wait till these guys come to life. Still looking at me and alive. There they go. I was waiting for them to come to life. Also, some soundtracks have been changed as well. There we go. Welcome to Real Overdose Modification. Very nice. Yeah, there you go. That's one of the things he says. Okay, that's good. Um, but yeah, he did change the soundtracks to a lot of the levels, actually. Not just a few of them. So, that'll be interesting. Those are bones for... Oh, hi. Oh, ouch. Um, as I was saying, those those are bones for, uh, well, he didn't even drop a soul. Interesting. Those are bones for the bone shotgun. We'll find that later. Get all the breakable objects here. I probably should have waited until that guy came to life. This is the Razor Cube. It functions just like the claw gun in the last game. Ooh, fire, fire enemies. Uh oh. Alright, use the screen. Okay. There we go. Uh, really, is improve your campaign experience and fixes. Yeah, so there you go. It's just kind of giving you a little description as to what you're getting yourself into. No more barrels around here, right? Okay. Oh, I didn't even notice that was there. That was ammo for the laser thing that comes out of this demon head. Oh, God. Oh, okay, that actually kills them in one hit. That's good. I don't know if they can still burn you after they're dead, too, so I'm kind of worried about that. Oh, God. Come on. All right, there we go. There we go. We got him. That music's a little loud. I'm gonna... Oops. I don't want that. I'm going to... Turn that down just a wee bit. There we go. Okay... Could be something up there. I don't want to burn myself though. Eh. Maybe not. 
Maybe one of these doors. Well, that's where I came from, but maybe that door will open up when I come back or something. I don't know. So when I was doing the test run, I didn't find... I only found one of the secrets. And it was the one that was over there. Otherwise, the rest of them I didn't find, so... No clue where they're at. The bunny... Oh, yeah, it's talking about this. Where I... You bee hop everywhere and you move faster. That's what it's talking about. There are barrels everywhere. Oh, here we go. Here's the bone shotgun. Take a peek at this cool animation. That's pretty cool. Oh god, alright, we're getting straight to it. Nice. Use the barrels to your advantage. Oh gosh. Give me that. That hurt a lot. Whew. Oh, you're still alive. Dang, really? Oh, man. This is not good. Oh, God. Holy cow, you guys are tough. Oh, they spawned right behind me. Oh, that one hasn't come to life yet. Oh, God. Whew. These guys are scary. Okay. We're okay. Oh, I don't have any more of those. There we go. Scream them to death. Because that's how that works. <laughs> Whew. All right. Imagine I just killed myself right there. <laughs> I would have been pretty sad. Okay. All right. We're doing okay. We're we're fine. We're we're okay. Make sure I didn't miss any barrels or breakable objects around here I don't think I can come up here no I can't and I can't no I can't jump in that okay well let's continue ooh yes give me some armor oh boy Come on. Oh, it hit the breakable pot behind him. Oh, God. There we go. Okay. That wasn't too bad. I don't know if I can get that coin. Damn. Got all that. Okay, I don't think I'm missing anything in here. I'm pretty sure I'd die if I fall on that. So I definitely don't want to do that. Oh boy. There we 
you go. <laughs> you tell him, Belial. You tell him. Oh, shit. There we go. Beautiful. That's the freezing version of this gun. It turns him to stone. Instead of ice. Oh yeah, they got cool death animations as well. There we go, there's that. I wonder if there's something hiding up there. Or up behind any of these statues, to be honest. There might be something. There could be something hiding. Oh god, don't fall in that. Can't destroy those. Oh my gosh. There we go. <laughs> Was a little unnecessary, but... Oh, his shield's blocking it. There we go. Necessary health. Okay. Easy enough. Ooh, is there something hiding up here? I can kind of walk up that. No, eh, maybe not. Anything hiding up on these little ledges? I wasn't really paying attention. Eh, doesn't look like it. Does not appear that way. Hmm. I don't really see anything behind the statue's legs on any of those up there, so... Don't know. Well, nope, let's move on. Owie. Oh god. I got stuck. Alright. All I have is this, pretty much. I didn't want to hit you. Die. Alright, there we go. Problem solved. With some stone. Okay, I don't think there's a floor. I was trying to, I saw through that little slit right here, and there is a floor back there, but there's like nothing right here, so I don't think this little door will ever open up. I think that's just there. Oh god. Are well hidden? Look around there. Yep. Yep. Plenty of secrets. The fire elements are back. Oh god, oh lordy. I'm already about to die. No, oh, please tell me there's health back here. Nope. Shit. Oh, yep, there it is right here. I walked right past it. Okay. There we go. Feel a little bit better now. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, I forgot about the cyborg things.
Well, I'm almost out of demon mode. Sorry, just keep bee hopping around. There you go, there's your next soul, right there. There we go. Now, unfortunately, this one doesn't have that same yelling feature that will send all the souls towards your way. Maybe he could. Maybe he can probably add that in the future. I don't know. It's a possibility that he will. Because yeah, that was definitely a really nice and handy feature, where you, all you had to do was right click and it would do this yelling thing and yeah, it would send all the souls that were out on the field your way. Oh, you're behind here. Have fun, fellow mortals. Yes, sir. Okay. So yeah, this one I do remember there's levers out here. Yep. There's three in total. There's there's two out here, and then there's one inside this big old temple. I think the other one is here. Yep. And then yeah, the other one is inside. I haven't seen any of the other secrets yet, though. Actually, is there is there one up here? ground shook and it made me fall off. Don't think so. Oh, I couldn't even climb on top of that. Okay, well, if I can't do that, there's probably not one on any of these other pillars. Yeah, probably not. Alright, well, we will come back outside for that one once we get this third lever. Very atmospheric. There we go. There's some more ammo for the head. There are way too more of them line up. Because that attack goes through everybody. So you can get more than one in one yell. Oh god. Come on, line up. Oh, they do kind of zigzag a little bit. Ooh, that was a good one. Oh, big boy. Big boy. Ooh. All right, big boy's already down. That actually wasn't too bad. Oh, I missed. All right, just get rid of them. So they have shields that are very annoying to deal with. These guys do too, but they don't have long range attacks. So they're not as much of a nuisance. Else there. Got one more little vase right here. Alright. Very cool. Can I get on top of this? I cannot. No, there's definitely got to be something up there. No way there's not. I have a very strong feeling there is something up there. Oh, 
Oh yeah, look at all that ammo. I'm curious if... Oh, I can't even jump into it. There's that third lever. I was trying to get the health. Hmm. Wonder if any of these fires are holding or hiding a secret portal, maybe. I don't know, maybe not. It just I I have a very strong feeling that something is hiding up there. Like surely. There's something. I don't think I can climb this, but... No. Did one of these heads do something, maybe? No. What about this one? Nope. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. Maybe not. Alright, well, let's get this one. And there you go. Nice little guitar riff on your secret areas. Huh. Well, if there is something there, I guess we'll have to come back for it. Oh god. Alright, just take care of him. Oh, he didn't die. Damn. There he goes. Okay, well he did just say that. I promise there's a lot more variety in his voice lines, even though he did just say that. Why am I climbing that? I just want the ammo. Please. I just want the ammo. There we go. Nothing there. Nothing there. Oh, another big guy. Oh my gosh. There we go. Big guy down. Nice. This looks really cool. Like I said, very, very tense, very atmospheric and chaotic. Shit was falling down or something. Um. I don't think I can... I can go... Oh god, okay. Yeah, I can go back there, but... I'm gonna die trying. He very well could be hiding something back there, though. But, like, I don't want to find out, because I'm gonna die trying. Same thing with back here. Yeah. I doubt anything would be hiding back there. All right, well, let's keep going. Ooh, yeah. Go ahead and give me that. Ooh, that was close. There we go. 
easy way to get rid of those guys. That works. Oh, missed. Come on. Bitch. That's what you get for throwing shit at me. Oh, God. Oh, another one. Oh, my gosh, another one. Oh, jeez, they're everywhere. Okay, there we go. Taken care of. Nice. Nice. Okay. One thing that kind of is goofy with the shotgun, the, the, I, this is just kind of me nitpicking at it. The, uh,. The sound of the shell casings that hit the ground is it's like a normal metal brass casing. It'd be kinda cool if that sound was like uh like bones hitting the ground or something, or like bone shells. Since this is a shotgun that shoots bone shards. I don't know. Like I said, that's just me nitpicking. Let's see if anything's back here. Hold on. Grab that just in case I fall in the pit. Yes, there is. Nice little secret stash. Oh, okay. The head is full. Doesn't want no more. What? What is that? Is it just like... Worms? Or grubs? That's what that looks like. The head doesn't need any more grubs at the moment. Nothing else here. Oh, actually, can I get up here? Mm, no, I cannot. Hold on, let me try one more time. Oh, that looks a little goofy. <laughs> no, I cannot get up here. Okay. No can do. All right, well, let's keep going. Enough of that. Very nice. Oh, yeah, I should mention, too, the enemies don't have that same... Uh, headshot hitbox feature where if you hit them in the head they can die much faster this mod does not have that again this is all stuff that he very well could potentially put in in later updates so or has thought about already doing it later on anyway so just keep that in mind all right get a soul Very nice. Very cool. Oh, there's a keyhole. Very nice. Oh. All right, I had to burn myself a little bit to get that key, but. Oh boy. You know what? These guys aren't actually as tough as I thought they would be. Juicy. Juicy. Alright, let's get this.
Very nice. Oh! This guy doesn't look very happy. I mean... Makes sense. I've murdered a bunch of his buddies. Is it alright if I take that golden figure off your hands, though? Oh. Haha, <laughs> that's, that's cool. Okay, I can't... I can't do anything to him, he's just there. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to... Okay, alright. You know what, I'm just gonna... You seem like you're... in a pretty... rough mood. I'm, I'm just gonna let you be. Alright, buddy. But yeah, there's a lot of secrets that are like that, too, where... he has enemies just kinda... hanging out, doing their own thing. That's pretty cool. I like that. Alright. So that's three secrets. Oh god. Oh god. Oh lordy. Alright, we still got that one. Good. Oh gosh. Alright, yeah, take care of this guy first. There we go. Whoa, he just exploded into a bunch of chunks. Alright, then get rid of you. Oh god. Oh lordy. Oh no, not another one. Ooh, that was a good one. Ow. That wasn't very nice. Sorry, we took care of him. Give me that. I doubt anything is up there. So I doubt that he would put anything in an area, even if you can get to it. Like, I'm probably still gonna die if I try and do that, so... Really doubt he put anything there, but you know what? He very well could've. If he really wanted to be that way. What is this last secret? Okay, it's a holy item. It is a holy item. Could it be up here? Hold on, let me get this. Checkpoint. Make sure... And I'll just spawn back here if I die. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Alright. I cannot go up there. Ouch. Huh. Alright, well let me take one more quick look. Actually, wait. Is there... A lot of health in that area. Okay. I don't see anything else. I don't think I can get on these pillars either. I'll take one more look back here. Nope, I don't see anything. No, nope, can't do anything with that. Okay, well, I'm going to reload that checkpoint so I have all my health back. Okay. Alright, let's... Make our way in here. Big ol' armor. Full torso and everything. Alright. We got cool battle music for the end. I 
that is actually quite loud still. Okay, there we go. It's drowning out pretty much every other sound in here. Oh gosh. Yeah, the fire alternates from the outer ring in the middle. Oh god. Oh shit. Get out of the middle. Whew. All right, now give me the soul. Okay, there's one big guy down. Oh my gosh, okay. Whew. Okay, there we go. That's what I wanted. Get rid of this big guy. Oh, he's down. Okay. Good. Oh, God. Get out of the middle. Oh, hi. Blended in with the fire. Perfect. Okay. Um, we can come up here. Is the holy item there? No. It is also not here. Interesting. This pillar seems like it can break. Yeah, maybe not. I don't have any explosives yet, so... I don't think that that is possible. Did I at least get all the... Okay, I at least got all the objects, so... That's good. Um... Can I... I don't really see anything glowing up there. It very well could be up there, though. I don't know if I can get high enough to... be able to climb that. Hmm... Where could this be? Yep, I guess we'll go back and look for it. Mm -hmm. Oh shit, there it is! Okay, I'm gonna save. Got it. I walked right past it. I looked in this room earlier, didn't even see it. And I went through the entire level, and I, f I finally came back through this way, and, yep, there it was. Alright. There we go. Got all the secrets, and we got all the objects. Blessing. Increase the initial health to 150. Nice, not bad. I'm gonna go ahead and put that in there right now. Alright, that was Cataclysm. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you in the Japanese Massacre.